Good morning, literally good morning. It's not even 9 a.m. Good afternoon, good evening. This is Anne Marie of The Art of Healing, and I'm just sitting down to do my calendar to send emails out, and Spirit's like, nope, you're going to channel. So here I am, morning face. At least I brushed my hair. We are raw, we are the raw collective, and we are taking this opportunity to welcome all of you from this space. Back at this space, it is the first time that we are communicating through our dear one back in her sacred space in New York. We allow her to experience the emotions. We allow her to experience what it meant. Because if it wasn't for her space, for her will to create this space, dare we say we would not be here at this moment. We would not have this communication with her. So we allow her to feel this love. It is not a sadness, it is a love. It is a genuine love. Our purpose of being here this morning, and we do indeed understand how this dear one is concerned that she is called upon to turn on the recorder in the morning, when dare we say she is not even fully dressed. <laughs> but she is one of these servants. Let us rephrase that. She is one of these volunteers. She is one of these volunteers. That was a programmed word that came out of her consciousness, her subconsciousness, and we wish to redirect it at this time. We are wanting to express to all of humanity the importance of continuing, continuing to further Dig deep within you. Dig deep, dear ones, for those deeply buried weed roots. Continue to dig deep at this time. You are at the precipice of a great transformation. You want to ascend. You want to transform yourselves. You want to grow but you want to grow as the beautiful, healthy flower that you know you are. You do not want to grow entangled upon weeds of beliefs, of injuries, of sadnesses, of traumas. You do not want those weeds to wrap around you and keep you from ascending. Continue, dear ones, with all of the work that you do. Continue, dear ones, with all of your involvement. This dear one works very hard to create environments for you to change, for you to grow. Take advantage of it. We are not plugging her, and she knows, and you know, that her heart is in the right place. But dear ones, it is time. It is time. Well done. Well done. If you are hearing these words, you are hearing these words because you are meant to hear these words. You are meant to amp up all that you can do to bring light upon this earth. Do what you can but mostly do for yourself. Each choice of love you make will bring the light stronger to this planet. And the more light you bring into this planet, the easier the transition will be. Be grateful you are where you are. You are where you are because you are meant to be there. You are where you are because you agreed 
you said yes in your higher form to being who you are. So now that you are here in the incarnate form, in the density, walking on the ground, feeling the energies, creating your future, step up. Step up and do it. Look at your home. Make changes. Make changes. Whatever changes you need to make, make them now. That nagging thought that you've had in the back of your head for a long time, I really should do this, I really should do this, I really should do this, do it. Don't wait anymore. Now is the time to step up. Now is the time to create whatever it's going to be to make your life as filled with light as possible. Humans like to make things difficult on themselves by overthinking, by following the voice of the ego, and not listening to the joy of spirit. Look at your thoughts. Look at your wishes and your hopes. What's really stopping you from creating whatever it is that has been in your heart for a long time. What indeed is stopping you? Remember, dear ones, you are divine creator beings. You have forgotten that you are a tendril of source. You are an end point of the creator. Therefore, you are a creator. Don't give in to the voice of the ego. Create whatever it is that your heart has been telling you. That is your spirit guides nudging you to your future, nudging you to where your path is taking you. Listen. Release any hold you have and run towards love, run with joy. Understand that whatever your mind is going to create in terms of a problem truly only exists in that ego mind. We love you, we are Ra, we are the Ra Collective. We send you our deepest blessings. And we thank this dear one for being so open and so willing to follow the call. She could have said, nope, I'm going downstairs, I'm washing my face and I'm putting on makeup, but she didn't. And that's what we love about her. And that's what you love about her. And thank you, we thank you, and we love you. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> All right. <sighs> okay, so I am sitting here updating my website. I am going to be putting um, all my Ear Prayer Warrior links and information on there. So uh, go check it out. <laughs>